Tony just at Candy Stripes galloping then. How'd she go? Yeah, I thought her work was good, Edward. Uh, you know, she uh, worked with Buffering, who's you know, a much better performed horse than she is, and uh, she tends to be a bit of a lazy worker. That's the reason we brought her here this morning, but I thought her last, uh, last bit of her work was quite good. Last time she ran, she ran fourth to Niriani at Sandown. How'd she come through that run? Yeah, no, she came through really well. Um, just had a little hiccup going into it and probably didn't train it as well as I should have. Uh, I think uh, she'll be better prepared going into Friday night's race. And what's she running in on Friday night? There's a mare's race here over 1,200 metres. Uh, yeah, she's a mare that I think's got good ability and hopefully get to black type. Uh, maybe not this prep, but in the future. And, uh, you know, the way she, I think this track will suit her. It's got a bit of natural give in it and I think that's what she looks for. And where would you like to see her in the run on Friday night, roughly? In front on the line, Edward. Uh, but in the run, oh no, she, she'll travel probably midfield uh, with a good closing sprint. And after Friday night, have you got a plan mapped out for her? Well, if she goes well enough here Friday night, we might move to the Tristark on Caulfield Cup day, but uh, just depends on her results here. And how's the rest of the team, Tony, going? You happy with them? Yeah, we haven't got a lot of major players going into the spring. Uh, Verena Miss will probably be our best shot at winning a race over the carnival. Uh, but we've got some nice young horses on the way through, so uh, uh, no good competing unless you're going to be good enough at this time of the year. So hopefully the ones that are out there will, will do the job. And how's she coming along, Verena Miss? Yeah, she's really good. She's probably going to run at Flemington on, on, uh, on Sunday, that is, uh, in the Gilgai, and that'll be her first run back, but she's coming along nicely. And after the Gilgo, she'll, she'll stick to the sprints or will she head to race like the uh, My Classic on Derby Day? Yeah, the Mire will be her grand final, so uh, she'll have another run in between and hopefully be ready to perform.